Welcome to the Center of Math's basic series on field theory. Today we're going to talk a little bit about ruler and compass. So, uh, ruler and compass, you're just you're given two points. You have a ruler and a compass. You have a straight edge and a compass, and you're making uh, whatever shapes you can with this. And it turns out you can only make certain shapes with these rules. So. So uh, we start with two points. Uh, we say they're at 0, 0 and 0, 1 in the, uh, the plane. Uh, or say 0, 0, uh, 1, 0 doesn't make really any difference. Uh, so we say we can draw a line between, we can make the, uh, the line determined by any two points with our straight edge. We can make the circle centered at one point and uh, has another point on it with our compass, and any intersections between circles or lines, or uh, those will be constructible points. So they're points that we can specifically accurately make. Uh, so we say number a is constructible. We can construct two no points, uh, absolute value of a apart. So if a is constructible, minus a is also constructible. So we can show given a point P and a line L, we can, uh, and the point P is not on the line L, we can construct another line going through P that is parallel to the line L. And to do this, say we have some line L, it's determined by two points A, B, uh, we have another point P. First we're going to draw a circle radius PB centered at B and it will intersect L at some point D. Then we're going to draw a circles of radius PB around D and, uh, and P. And so note B, D, uh, and then where these two circles intersect, we call it E. Uh, B, D, E, B, D, D, E, E, P, and P, B. P, B has uh, radius P, B. B, uh, B, D from our construction also has radius P, B. Same for D, E, E, P. So this is the rhombus. All sides are the same length. And so, so Two opposite sides are parallel, and so we, so we see PE, in fact, uh, will construct our desired parallel line. Uh, so, constructible numbers, uh, we can prove constructible numbers form a subfield of R. So, we just want to uh, show. Their addition and subtraction is closed, and their multiplication is closed, and we have inverses. Uh, so first, for addition and subtraction, it's fairly straightforward. So we have uh, so two constructible numbers, a and b. So we have two points, a, b, length a apart. We have some other points, length b apart. Uh, so we're going to make a circle around b of, uh, of length little b. And so, so yeah, uh, on uh, making the line between a and b, uh, and making the circle around B. We'll see where the circle intersects this line. We have uh, A with one intersection is length A minus B, A, and the other intersection will be length A plus B. So A plus B and A minus B are, we can quickly show that we can construct these numbers as well. So for multiplication and inverses, Say we have constructible numbers A and B again. Uh, so 1, we know is a constructible number. Uh, so we have 1, we have, uh, yeah, we have B. We have, and we're, we're going to start this all at 0, 0. We have some line uh, that's not parallel to this line. Uh, and we construct a point length A away from. So we have some point length A away from the center. We have these two points length one and b away. And from what we previously proved, uh, so we can construct this line between uh, these two points. And so we can construct a parallel line uh, going through b. And where this b uh, intersects this point, this will be uh, length ab from the center because uh, the ratio, the length from, the ratio of this length to a is the same as the ratio of b to one. So we just multiply a by b. And so we get ab. 
Uh, we do a similar thing for the inverses. So we have one A, one, and one over A is closer to the origin. Uh, so yeah, we can make the point from uh, length one away from the origin on this arbitrary line. Uh, length A away, uh, one also uh, on this bomb line here. And so once again, we're going to construct a parallel line. And we get uh, this point here that intersects going through one, intersects the bomb line. It'll be one over A away from the origin. So one over A will also be constructible. And so we have closure under addition, subtraction, multiplication, uh, inverses. And so the constructible numbers uh, do, in fact, form a field. So uh, something you can't show, but we won't, we won't show here. For uh, constructible number A, the extension Q uh, with A appended over Q, uh, this field extension will have degree some power of two. And you can show this by looking at the intersections between circles and lines and seeing how uh, the numbers are kind of uh, satisfied quadratic equations. Uh, and so th this theorem, in fact, shows for this, you can already get so that some constructions are, in fact, impossible such as trying to construct a cube of which edge with volume two, because that would imply the edges have length two, uh, cube root of two, and the extension Q with cube root of two appended over Q is three, which is not power of two, and so we cannot construct the edges of this cube, and so we can't. Uh, that's an impossible construction. Uh, thanks for watching. Please check out sendermap.org, check out our blog, follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Thank you. <laughs>